it's me again, Jamie. In today's video, I will be sharing with you my one day travel beauty essentials. So, if you're interested to know of what beauty products I bring with me when going on a hot, hot, sunny 12 hour trip, just keep on watching. This girl in front of you is not a light packer. Obviously not. But I think a lot of girls are. Let's just say that this video is for the girls out there, just like me, has the urge of bringing ton of products and end up not using it. So the challenge would be bringing only products that will fit in this bag. So enough gibberish. Let's get started. So we gonna do this tonight. So, so FYI, we are going on a beach and we are going to roam around the island called Ireland. No. Ireland. Doesn't sound right. Ireland. 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 It spells like O and two dots on the top. My boyfriend's gonna kill me because of this. I have to ask again about the pronunciation. By the way, I already put my skincare on. Mind you that we're going to be exposed in the sun for 12 hours. So refrain from using products that have salicylic acid on it. A facial wash like this, for example. Just try to use a very, very mild facial wash. Also refrain from using oils or vitamin C that will burn your skin. Also, I already apply this on my skin. This is called the Nature Republic Soothing and Moisture Aloe Vera Soothing Gel. I like to use this product a lot whenever I'm going out instead of using lotions because this one doesn't make your feel sticky, leaves your skin smooth and soft. Next, these are the skincare products that I'm going to bring with me. Let's talk about first the most important one, sunblock. First, we're going to bring the Etude House Sun Price Mild Airy Finish SPF 50 plus plus plus. No words for this one. You know that this is my all-time favorite sunblock for the face. It has the right ingredients. It's so minty when you smell it. It's so cool when you pull it on the face. It's mild. It's non-sticky. It's a very, very good product. Next would be the sunblock for the body. It's called Nevea Sun Protect and Moisture Support Skin Barrier 30 SPF. What I love about this is it's water resistant. Well, this is not mine, this is my boyfriend's, but sometimes I use it. <laughs> you know that we have to use sunblock every two hours, right? Religiously. So we're going to bring the Innisfree Extreme UV Protection Stick SPF 50. Plus, plus, plus. You know, whenever you feel like you are all sticky, you are so oily, and you cannot freshen up, this is a really a good product. The UV Mineral Sun Kill RX 46 plus, plus, plus SPF. This is like a powder that you put on top of your face. It's just like additional sun protection that doesn't make you feel sticky and oily. Next would be a makeup remover. I don't really use makeup remover that much. I only use this when I am traveling and wiping lipsticks on my lips. That's it. It's just as much as possible. I don't like doing any friction in the skin with my face. So I refrain from using those. But unfortunately, when traveling, it's really hard not to use it. If you cannot reach water, it's the only way of removing the gunk, the dirt, the oiliness with your skin. So we have no choice. 
Next, I'm going to bring my Eucerine Aquaphor Soothing Skin Balm. A lot of you know that this is one of my favorite products. I also discussed this in my other video. This is so versatile. You can use this on your lips, on your skin. This is really, really a great moisturizer for your lips. Next would be my Claire's Freshly Juice Vitamin E Mask. I just really have to bring this. I can't live without this moisturizer. This is the moisturizer. That makes my skin really, really glowy. Another product but for the hair is the Lanza Keratin Healing Oil. Just like your skin, your hair also needs and deserves sun protection, right? So moving on to the makeup. I'm going to bring the Etted House. Look at my eyeshadow of Etted House. Look at my eyes. In the shade of A30119A, the Benefit Positine Cheek and Lip Tint. The Nor Shade 1 Lip Gloss. Dan, dan, dan. Smoke, smoke, smoke. Fire it up, let our lanterns paint the night sky red. Paint the night sky red. My Shuimura Eyelash Curler. The Max Factor Lash Crown. Sometimes, if I need a touch up outdoors, and it's really convenient to bring the Moonshot. Microfit Setting Fit Cushion in the shade of 301. This is considered a summer cushion because it has a high SPF 50 plus plus plus. Of course, I'm not gonna leave this behind my The Face Shop Ink Graphy Eyeliner. Also, my Nature Republic Soothing and Moisture Aloe Vera Soothing Gel Mist. This can actually take your, all your problems away. It's so, so refreshing to use. Like, Of course, I have something for my hair as well. This is a travel size teasers. You can actually use this whenever your hair is still wet or dry. And it is also a detangle for the hair so this is a must 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 to bring and last but not the least this is not considered as a beauty product but I'm pretty sure that this is a must have because it protects us from sun exposure and this protects us from wrinkles and also premature aging And from eye wrinkles.
enjoy packing with me and seeing the places where I've been to. Also, let me know what other beauty related ideas you wanted to see in this channel. You can type it in the description down below. And if you like this video, don't forget to click the thumbs up button. You may consider to subscribe to my channel as well. You are all welcome here. Don't forget to hit the notification bell right there. Oh, by the way, we are receiving a lot of comments lately. From now on, my favorite comments will be popping out right there. Oh, 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 oh,